All right, let's look at this pop culture news. We got Modoc confirmed to be appear in the Quantumania movie. They just dropped a new She-Hulk trailer. In the trailer, it gives a glimpse of Daredevil with hints of yellow in his suit. It also confirms the Wrecking Crew a part of the uh, trailer. We get into season three of the What If series. Spider-Man freshman year animated series is stated for 2024 release. And we get into season two of, of Marvel Zombies, even though it's not even out yet. X-Men 1997 debuts in fall of 2023. We get a limited TV series for The Walking Dead uh, featuring a love story between Rick Grimes and Miss Shoney. I don't watch Walking Dead, so don't get mad at me if I butcher names. Marvel's also launching a solo series for the South Korea's Tiger Division. Netflix doing an Avatar Last Airbender movie and the first Netflix movie will focus on Aang and his friends as adults. The Berserker comics are getting a live action and an anime project at Netflix. This is the Berserker series made by Keanu Reeves. We might get an introduction to the Inhumans in the MCU again. There's a Twitter handle going around right now. We don't know what's going on with it. Netflix finna do a movie of the, uh, the Goon. We getting a spinoff series of the Justice Society from the Black Adam movie. We got a new Shazam trailer, Fury of the Gods. Amanda Waller's confirmed to be in the Black Adam movie. We get a trailer for the interview of the uh, vampire. Cassie Lang is gonna be suited up in the Quantumania movie. Go check out that new Sandman trailer that just dropped. Daredevil on Disney Plus will have 18 episodes and it will be called Daredevil Born Again, coming in spring of 2024. The Captain America 4 movie will be called New World Order. I was just about to end the video, but then this popped up. We're getting Adam Warlock in the damn new uh, Guardians of the Galaxy movie. And the higher evolutionary. And we getting Cosmo the Space Dog. Let's go. If anything else new pop up, I will be sure to let y'all know.